Thanks for checking out Scotty's Hobbies. Today, you're going to be looking at a video unlike any other video in my library. This is our experience going to Disney World this past weekend on 8-24, so it's August 24th. You can see walking up to the transporter right here going over to the Magic Kingdom, there is nobody here. I was super surprised of how like open everything was. Uh, we obviously have our face masks on like everybody else does around us and everybody was properly social distancing. Welcome to the Magic Kingdom. You can see nobody is around. There's barely anybody around and a lot of people, or I'd say everybody was respecting our personal space. Right here is my beautiful significant other trying to figure out what we're gonna do uh, in the day that we had and Jeremiah right there. Look at nobody. There's like 20 people here in a spot where I've seen pictures. I've never been here before, but I've seen pictures of this place packed when people just walk in. So I was super stoked. Right here, Giovanna couldn't figure out what she wanted to do uh, walking into the park either. We were all just so excited. There was a lot of stuff shut down, but you can see rides are all like this. There's no lines for anything. You can walk right up to the ride and get on pretty much. We didn't wait more than 15 minutes at most for any ride that we rode, and we rode every open ride that was in the Magic Kingdom. Right here, looking at the castle, you get the best pictures with this pandemic, other than your face covering on. Uh, it's still beautiful, it's still fun. There was some closed stuff, but for what it was, we got to ride every single ride in the park that was open and still have time left over. We left a couple minutes early to avoid the little bit of traffic getting out what there was. But you can see right here in line, in front of us, we have stickers that separated our parties, so or every party from six feet from each other, so we had to social distance. Walking around, there is directional arrows on where to go and uh, which way to go, so that we all have proper direction. We had people constantly reminding you to keep your face mask on, but all in all, this was a blast, and I would recommend if you could make it, go now while you can. A lot of the park was shut down, but you could see they did their best to provide uh, the parades that they have. This parade continuously went throughout the day, but it was pretty cool, and they are very vibrant. They did their best social distancing, and you could see the park staff, when they're walking around clearing the area, they also had their mask on and were making everybody observe uh, common courtesy, pretty much, by keeping their masks on, other than while eating. Uh, everything, all in all, was super fun. Uh, the park was well worth the price to like give and take of how much it cost to get in and what was closed compared to the uh, how long the, the lines were for the ride so I think it was a good give and take the kids loved it I loved it it made me actually want to go back to Disney World um, and really I never thought we'd be able to afford something like this so thank you guys for everything you do as subs make sure you like subscribe and share check from links in the description below if you want to take a trip to disney world i might put some helpful links on there like subscribe and share and i'll see you on the next hopefully helpful video